Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Uh, Nur Zaman is here. We are going to uh, discuss about fragment, Android fragments. That what are the actually fragment? Why we use it? Those fragment concept was not available with the Android previously. It this concept coming after the Android 3.0. Uh, fragment you can consider fragment just like an activity it is a sort of activity within activity so we can say that the fragment are actually the sub activities are the mini activities and one activity or the one fragment can be active at one time or at the next time uh, fragments means as we discussed that there are the kind of the mini activities and those kind of the activities may be more than two are uh, two or more than two I'm going to discuss about its basic example and just to see that how we can uh, make the two different screens are the sub activities within our one main, main activity as you can see from this example that this is the fragment number one and this is the fragment number so you, we can say that these are actually the two activities within the one activity so this is very simple we, we uh, are just trying to see that this example how this is working this example is very much simple uh, the name for this example is the fragments what we did we uh, add the two uh, uh, with the uh, two XML file with uh, the layout number one is actually kindly follow to my mouse pointer fragment one which is holding the green color background and this is showing that this is the fragment number one and the other one which is the fragment number two which is showing the blue color and showing the text that this is the fragment number two and with the main dot xml what we are trying we are trying to separate our main activity into the tool you can see from here that this is our fragment number one uh, the fragment number one and the other one is actually that the fragment number two and here with the layout weight what we are trying to do we put the weight one here and weight one here this weight is actually defining us giving us that the uh, the weightage for both of the fragments will be equal so means 50 percent screen size will go for the fragment number one and the 50 percent size of the skin will go to the fragment number two once we will see uh, about our uh, fragment number fragment one and fragment two java files and then we will come back to uh, apply the changes to change from this value from one to different and again to change this value uh, from one to make it different and then we will see that what kind of effect is actually coming to our uh, app so now we are moving to our fragment number one this is our fragment number one file you just see this is a very simple we are not doing anything while we are just using here the concept about the inflator inflator is actually a concept which is what we are uh, trying to use why we are trying to use with uh, our with the help uh, with the help of the inflator what we are uh, if we just uh, define it in a, a very basic way so we can say that if you want to add the views pro programmatically you can inflate the XML file layout files actually uh, the inflating a view means converting a view from the XML into a view object or we can say that with the help of this inflator we are trying to uh, separate our screens rest is nothing the concept is the same R and layout fragment one and container false so if we just have a look for the fragment number two so you will find again the same that we are just using the inflator what we discussed right now and then again the uh, R and layout and the container because we are not doing anything we are just trying to uh, uh, create the two different screens the two uh, mini activities within our main activity now we are trying to have a look for the frag fragment activity main.java file so here you can see again we did not do anything just on the on create method what we are doing that we are calling the r dot layout dot the main now we are trying to run our file so we want to see that how it's working uh, the primary the basic things we just escape it because we hope that you understand about these things so we are just going to um, uh, run this our application and just come up here so our application is, is started this is the fragment number one and this is the fragment number two if we just press the control f11 we want to 
rotate our uh, screen for our emulator so you can see that we create the two mini activities within the one activity so just uh, press the control f11 uh, once again just to see that how it is now we are just trying to uh, do the some more options just to see that what kind of the difference will come to our this app now we are with our main xml file just follow to my mouse pointer we're just trying to change its weight from one say for example that we are trying to make it to the fra uh, fra fragment number one as a two and keep this one as it is and now we want to see that what kind of the effects are going see this is what we did we just try to change the weight for the fragment number one but we make it as a two see with my mouse pointer and we kept this one as the one the same uh, like as before so you can see that what is the difference the difference is comes that the fragment number one activity having now the largest size while the fragment number two having the similar size i hope this is a very simple example what we discuss about the fragment just to give you a concept that fragment is just nothing it's only uh, activity within an activity we'll discuss it further in our uh, class lecture we will try to uh, come up with uh, to cover with the different uh, concept with the different angles now once you, when you will be uh, once when you will be more comfortable with this uh, uh, fragment and understand the concepts then we will go for another example uh, in our next class that will show us that how we can use that fragment in our list view uh, say uh, just like this yeah please this is another example this is what we are using with the list fragment example so here are in, in the format of the list we are using the name of the different cities and the countries like Mecca, Medina, Riyadh, al -Aisa and Mecca, Medina, Riyadh, al -Aisa and Damam and al -Kubar. so suppose for example you just click to any one uh, city Damam so it's showing that you have selected the Damam you are sitting, selecting to al khobar you have selected al khobar and if you're selecting the Riyadh so it's showing you that you have selected the Riyadh so congratulations uh, for understanding that this basic concept and in our next video we will discuss it how this list fragment example is working so uh, Masala.